get discouraged. So, yeah, pretty good. She's been talking about you guys. This might be the best one yet. Guys, it's crazy. I'm talking about double my revenue. So before an event, I actually like to take listing photos if I made anything that's actually worth posting on Etsy. And this time around, just because I've been adding the bows onto my keychains and phone charms, I had a lot that were actually worth posting on there. I like to take those pictures in case they do sell at the event. And good thing I did because, uh, <laughs> hint, hint. I actually think this pattern one would be super cute for my strawberries. I've been using like pink and it's been kind of clashing I feel like so. Now I'm just making a few extra pieces before the event tomorrow just in case I uh sell out. Hint hint. Here are the keychains so far. I think they're so cute with the bows. I'm probably never gonna go back to just simple keychains without the bows because I feel like it just adds so much. I also feel like it would kind of persuade the buyers to buy these for 15 because this looks like a $15 keychain, you know what I mean? <laughs> and same with the phone charms too. Like that looks like a $10 purchase right here. set up. Here's the earrings. I think everything looks pretty good. So one thing that can definitely alter your want to actually vendor, it, it may seem like really slow at first for like the first couple hours, but don't get discouraged and it gets a lot busier. 80% of the time, 80% of the time. So this might be my best one yet. It's only like seven o'clock and the event started at six o'clock. And it's like, I think I've made around $200. So yeah, pretty good. Usually around this time, I use, I, I make around like 50 to 100, but yeah, like 200, that's, it's kind of crazy. Oh, thank you so you look so cool. Your makeup, oh my gosh. Please, you are so crazy. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. She's been talking about you guys. Why? Stop. Stop. Stop it. I love, I love hearing that. It makes it my heart. My heart. That's so sweet. I love you. Have a great one. Oh my god. You're all so pretty. Thank you. They're really pretty. Thank you. Feel free to try anything on. Touch it. Feel if you like. Thank you so much. Have a great you as well, take care. Okay, perfect. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice one. This is crazy. There's so many people. I'm gonna run out. I'm gonna run out now. Oh my gosh. Only like four left. That's crazy.
One hour left of the event, and I'm down to one and one right now. Oh my goodness. That's crazy. I've never like almost sold out before. And then this is the phone. I got two. It is um, 10.30. I'm so tired. And it is coming to the end of the night. And I'm so, I'm so excited. I count my cash box. Okay, so I was too exhausted to record the takedown process, but here we are one week later. That was undoubtedly my most successful vendor event yet. What What's really crazy is that I've been participating in this event for exactly a year now, and it was just so much more successful than any other month I was a vendor in. Like, I'm talking about doubling my revenue. So with that being said, here are my analytics from the event. But wait, that's actually not including cash. I made a total of $417 in cash that night as well. Isn't that crazy? I made a total of 33 online sales that night. More than 33 people came by and bought items for me in a total of six hours. And what's awesome too is I literally received tips from a, a couple of people. Tips I didn't even ask for. Crazy. My biggest advice to you is make sure you're kind to your customers. Befriend them in a way. You have the luxury of being able to talk to your supporters face to face. So make sure you would just ask them about feedback that you've been pondering on. Don't just be kind to customers, but also be kind to your fellow vendors as well. I can't tell you how much valuable feedback I've received from both vendors and customers just by asking them and befriending them. If you're a small business owner, I really hope this vlog gave you motivation to go to your next vendor event. I actually have a video about all the reasons why it'll help your small business grow to amazing new heights while having fun with it as well. I would love to hear any feedback you have from both constructive and positive feedback. If you don't want to leave it in the comments, you can also message me on any of my social media platforms if you'd like to have like a private conversation. If you'd like to purchase from me, check out my link tree. I have all my links on there. My main platform that I use to sell my jewelry is actually Etsy, so you can check that out. And then thank you so much for watching and I hope you have an amazing day.